So you have now found out you're about to start on your journey towards surgery. You're about to meet lots of different members of your medical team, all who have different roles to play and who are there to support you. So first of all, you'll come in for a pre-admission day. This is quite a long day and you'll meet a lot of different people. You're going to spend most of the time with a nurse who's going to do your observations, height and weight, and also will do some tests. These can be swabs, which will be in the mouth and up the nose, and blood tests. On your pre-admission, you will often meet the surgeon to do consent. The surgeon will often draw diagrams for you and it is really important that you listen and ask any questions that you have at this point. So when you arrive at hospital, you'll be met by the staff nurses on the ward and also your surgical team will come to see you before surgery as well. From the ward, you'll be taken to theatre where you'll meet the theatre team. You'll meet the anaesthetist who you will have seen previously on the ward and the anaesthetist's assistant, called ODPs. An anaesthetist is in charge of looking after your airway and breathing when you're in surgery. You meet them on the day of your surgery and they come and assess your breathing and talk to you about what they will do. It is their job to make sure that your airway and breathing are safe the entire time and that's all they do. It's really important to feel a level of trust within your surgical team, your medical team and your nursing team. Take comfort from the fact that they are there to work with you and they are expert in what they do. They've trained for so long, for so many years to be able to look after you during your procedure and they've also done it so many times before that you're very much in safe hands.